Hey everybody, welcome to another amazing episode of The Unbox Boys! Do like a whistle thing. Oh. <laughs> I know. I I'm Dave. This is my son, Elias. <laughs> That's, that is my name. On today's episode, we uh, <laughs> open up a little geek happiness with the. Uh, nobody knew this, but this was one of the original members of Blue Man Group. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Okay, I was joking. But if he was a member of Blue Man Group, how much cooler would Blue Man Group be? Yeah. I'm just they saying. They would have a whistler. <laughs> and he would kill everybody who wasn't clapping. Uh, <laughs> from the uh, Marvel's Titus Build-A-Figure Wave from uh, Marvel, the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. <laughs> you all right? I'm just tired. You were eating something. That's why. <laughs> uh, Yondu. Uh, excited to see this figure. Let's check out the box. Uh the artwork on the side, that's a little bit of a, a notch up from the Groot Build-A-Figure Wave. Picture? It's like a picture. It's like a photograph. He's even got the fin there, which is kind of nice. Uh, same on that side. It does have the uh, Guardians logo on top there, which is nice. Bottom, not much to talk about. And on the back, uh, you get uh, him whistling. I think he's whistling to that song Blue by Blue Man Group. Uh, here's the... Uh, Titus Build-A-Figure Wave. So you have a couple new versions of older figures there. Drax and uh, Star-Lord uh, come in this. Uh, actually, they don't. Oh, yeah, he is over there. Uh, but then you've got some other figures there as well that are part of the uh, Guardians of the Galaxy lore, but not part of the movie necessarily mm -hmm. that's coming out. Uh, his backstory here, uh, a captain of a Ravager faction, Yondu is a powerful warrior shrouded in mystery. True story. So let's open it up and check out the slap. Every once in a while, an action figure comes along that restores my faith in humanity. Really? This is just such an action figure. I'm very excited about this one. <laughs> I think it looks good. Uh, let's uh, take a closer look at Yondu, shall we? The sculpt itself, uh, we have a second head. It actually came with this head on the body. Not part of the pencil. Let's get it focused in there for you there. That kind of uh, cheesy grin uh, that he's got there. But as far as the sculpt goes, very nicely done. Lots of good uh, detail in the in the cut, the wrinkles, uh, the lines, even the, the teeth and ears. This is just uh, fantastic. This one with the fin down. Then, is that really what it is? Uh, what do you call it? A fin? I'm not sure. Again, that's what the comment section down below is for. For you guys who actually really know your stuff about the comics and the characters. Let us know uh, things that we miss out on on the comments below. Do it nicely, please. <laughs> we admit we don't know everything. We don't really know anything. Um, I thought it was like kind of like hair kind of thing. Well, it's kind of a hair, but... Like you had to grow it out or something. I don't know. So this is like gel and hairspray that on yep. this day. In other days, it's just kind of slicked back. It could be. No, I thought... That the other head is from the older one. This one's from the newer one. Oh, oh I think it's a fin that goes up and down. But again, comments below. Let us know. <laughs> it's just inside uh, head, like. This face. Uh, well, he's an alien. It's not like he's just a dude. I know. So, I don't uh, know. Uh, this face. Uh, even I know, some nice, I don't know. <laughs> nice scruff there as well. Uh, the uh, outer, well, the inner uh, jacket here. Nice detail with all the buckles, the belt, uh, the uh, holster uh, there, even the legs. Uh, just really look good as far as the sculpt goes. The jacket, just again, a lot of nice detail even on the back there and, and some of this. Just looking really good. Sculpt on Yondu, I'm saying full point. Full point. On to the likeness of uh, Yondu. This is a great rendition of actor Michael Rooker in this role. Really looks like him a lot for, for uh, this value level of uh, action figure this is really actually very impressive uh, i'd say uh maybe even a little more so on that one uh than this one but both of them really look great mm -hmm. uh just a lot of good detail there and of course um as far as the, the the costume goes as well what he wears uh i'd say it's a fantastic likeness of the character and a fantastic likeness of the actor full point full point on to articulation this head is amazing. It just goes any direction. <laughs> it's really pretty cool. Wow, you're really funny. <laughs> but for the figure itself, uh, <laughs> the head uh, does go up and down uh, a bit. 
It's a little hindered in the back here by the uh, the, the collar. Uh, you can just go down a bit there as well. Side to side, again, hindered by the jacket, So, but it's with a normal, he's not human, but normal human parameters, I would mm -hmm. say. Perhaps if you took the jacket off, you could get a little more uh, out of here. And actually, that wouldn't even look necessarily bad because this kind of all goes mm -hmm. together nicely, so that wouldn't be too bad. Uh, as far as the arms go, a uh, nice kind of ball hinge there at the shoulder. Bicep twist, double jointed elbow, and the wrists go all the way around and up and down in a pretty good range. Same on the other side with an up and down uh, motion. Uh, again, with with the jacket off, you might get a little bit more as far as the ab crunch goes, but it still is pretty good. Uh, and it doesn't go back too far again, but I think that's because of the jacket hindering that. Uh, you've got a waist twist there. Uh, as far as the legs go, a uh, fairly good splits for Yondu. Uh, back and forth, doing really well. Uh, thigh cut, double jointed knee, and then a, uh, let's see, is there a boot cut too? There's not a boot cut there, that's alright. And then uh, the uh, foot uh, does go up and down, a little tight on this one, and it's got that fun swivel there. So I'd say great articulation on this one. Mm -hmm. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm so good. Not a big Yondu fan, apparently. Oh, I get it. Yondu. <laughs> yeah. See, I really appreciate the character. I just that's that's, that's how that's the custom cheer for Yondu. You have to yawn. That's yeah. yeah. <laughs> for their uh, articulation, full point. Full point. Finally, we go to the paint, and uh, I'll just say right out, I think this looks fantastic. Yeah, I, I think uh, the eyes uh, are nice. I mean, just enough white around there so you can see it. But the red eyes looking in the same direction. The only bummer about this one is it got a little bit of paint uh, smudged right there. That's not... I was wondering if that was like a birthmark or something, but it's it's not. It's not on this one, so it's just the luck of the draw of the one that I happen to get from the store. Uh, but even the uh, the jacket, some of the nice gold that they've done here as well, the uh, paint on the silver, even just the little black button details that they have there, buckles on here. Uh, it, not a lot of paint detail on the legs, but they do uh, they do just a nice job. Nice yeah. kind of wash on this uh, jacket. These new ones are getting better. Yeah, they really are. It's really good. So I would say for uh, the paint, full point. Full point. We're excited to see more of this character, Yondu, in the film Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 coming out next month. As far as the action figure goes from the Legends series, he gets four out of four on the slap scale. Falling over in shock of how good this figure is, I guess. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If so, be sure to slap that thumbs up and share it with your friends. Click our circular logo in the top left to subscribe to our channel. It's absolutely free. And there's a link to another video you might like in the bottom left. If you want to reach out to us, comment or check out our info in the description below. And above all, remember, God loves you. It's the truth. And Jesus is the proof. The Unbox Boys.